it's incredible to be able to share any of this with the world. Um, there is something I'm still kind of marveling at around a project of this size, having the kind of intimacy of this cast, and which makes sense, it's a family, um, uh, one of the original Marvel families, and, um, and so, the, 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 to be able to kind of like nest in that through this experience and then bring everyone else into it um, and, and, and share something that truly is, feels special. I think, I think, I, I feel that there's a lot of anticipa anticipation around it because it's taken a long time for Marvel to get back the original material and the fact that it was began and I remember when I first started researching Sue and I knew a lot about her but to go into the comics and to read her story and the fact that she passed through and all the characters passed through so many different artists that's what I loved and also the other thing I absolutely love is that this was like one of the main forms of entertainment in the 60s you know that that's how like popular in terms of popular culture we have so much now but the fact that these guys originated in a time when just the idea of like waiting for the comic to come out and w wonder what story was going to be next. And then to read our script and to see all the different um, components of those, of, the, of those narratives throughout the decades is so cool. To, to kind of inhabit and go, okay, so we're telling our version of, of this amazing you know, legacy of material with the, that have lived with so many people for so long. I think just being met with that much enthusiasm the fans for this stuff is just, they're so devoted. And so to be involved in this uh, this new Marvel family is just a very exciting prospect. It's very new, we're still yet to film it. So it's um, it was an amazing thing to yeah bear witness to and yeah be a recipient of all of that enthusiasm. You know? That energy from like, like Joe says, from the fans. You know, we haven't, we have, we've just started, so they're kind of throwing down the gauntlet. You know, it's a nice sort of challenge for us to, you know, to live up to. I mean, the energy in the room in Hall H is unbelievable. You know, hearing uh, just that excitement, that, that level of investment and excitement, which I have as a fan too, and so you just, it's really just unbelievable. You have to pinch yourself. So retro future 60s, so it's uh, similar to the 60s that you know, but then going to be different too. And so we've drawn on a lot of futurism from the 60s and merged it together with an actual period piece. It's really exciting. I love the investment. Um, I, uh, I'm grateful for it, you know. Um, it's really wonderful to make something and know that it's going to be a bunch of people out there waiting for it and excited to see it. Um, and that's, you know, as a creative person, that you can't beat that.